I have to admit that I'm terrified of snakes. I went for a walk in the park the other day and this little beanie greeny one slithered across my path. I jumped about two foot in the air, screamed out loud and burst into tears. Now I've got this panic thing, imagining that snakes are laying in wait for me. I couldn't go down that path again in the park. Not unless I knew a friend was with me holding my hand, helping me past the snake place. How humiliating is that? Oh. Two hours sleep I got last night. And what do you think I found by the kettle this morning? Your pants, a pair of your dirty pants on my kitchen surface. <laughs> Oops. It's not funny, Chloe. OK, OK, I'm sorry. He's gone, all right? Who has? Steve. Last night you were shouting out Paul. Was I? Sounds familiar. Oh, my God, you don't even know his name. Does it matter? Yes, it does. Anna, I got drunk last night and slept with someone. What's the big deal? The big deal is that you just finished your relationship, so you shouldn't be doing something like that. I didn't have sex for two years after I finished with Mike. I kissed him, one hand held deep in his hair, oily and thick. The one word he would never say. The word he couldn't stand. Love. I love you.